this is amazing. You know, Card Nation is out in full force today. We have this great partnership we arranged with Ram. We talked to them yesterday. We sent out an email. We told all of our Cardinal fans to be here, and they came out in full force. We have our former coach, Denny Crum. Uh, we have a former player, Daryl Griffith. We have alumni, we have fans, everyone drove up. It's Easter Sunday, and we're ready to beat the Devils. We're going to have the chance, right, uh, to advance and have a second consecutive year of a dance in the Final Four. But this time, we're going to go a little further. That's all. I mean, we're not stopping at the Final Four. We're not going to stop to the championship run. We're playing well. We're playing sick, both physically sick and mentally sick at the same time. So it's going to happen. Um, Duke's not ready. They're not ready. We lost by five without Gorgie. We lost, without, we lost by five without Russ playing all crazy like he is. Luke going off from three-pointers like he is. Uh, Ware's coming off the bench and turn things up. Man, we're going to kill it. Duke is out of here, baby. Yeah. I can't speak for Rick. I don't know how he'd feel. I'm sure he's anxious to get this game going and win. Uh, but uh, it was right here in Indianapolis in 1980 in, uh, uh, that Daryl Griffith, and his teammates and I and my assistant coaches and all our fans uh, came to Market Square Arena and uh, beat Duke in the national championship game. Now, I know this is a week away from that, but we got to beat Duke to get to the Final Four, so it's really not a lot of difference. I think that a lot of these fans, in fact, I know a lot of them have already been uh, coming up and talking to me about what a great time that was. And, they'd like to be able to relive that. We're not in the Final Four yet, but hopefully if we take care of business today, uh, we'll be in the Final Four, but it's just great. It's great to be a Louisville fan, and um, who would have thought that we'd be in, you know, won the Sugar Bowl and now heading on to hopefully Atlanta, so go Cards. Uh, I think also uh, Shane, Shane Bohannon's a big key factor in this game. Shane Bohannon, uh, he needs to, you know, make his presence on the inside down low, and and really be aggressive and you know show them that we're not joking around we want to go to the championship game it's it, Louisville's due for a championship I hope Duke, Duke is going to get their butts their butts kicked <laughs> out trouble with the big guy inside Plumlee uh, if Gordon can get going against him then I think we'll be sitting pretty good oh my god it's unbelievable I'm shaking right now this game can't get here soon enough Duke is going down by at least double digits. You heard it here first, John Green. Hey, it's Luke Oil Stadium today, baby. I hope Luke Hancock has a big game. You know, he, he's due for some hot threes, and I think, you know, us being an hour and a half away, man, it's just going to be big. I mean, just like Rupp Arena and turned into Russ Arena, and now Luke Oil Stadium, it's, it's going to be big. I'm excited. Everybody's pulled against them the whole time including all of our Kentucky brethren from the, all the Dukes. So uh, Leitner's late shot at that one time. So we're just hoping to pull out a good win here. And we were in um, New Orleans for the Sugar Bowl a couple of months ago. So that was a good time. So it's always nice when you got a team in town that you can travel with and go see all the games too. We have the best fans in the whole world. And they, yeah, best fans right here.